the big guns to the UN Climate Change Conference in Lima. Over the next 72 hours, top officials will join their delegations, joining the talks that have been underway for more than a week. CCTV Stephen Gibbs explores China's role. China has one of the largest delegations at this conference and its own pavilion hosting events and talks. The importance of China's policy regarding climate change cannot be understated. With its huge population and developing economy, it is currently the world's largest emitter of greenhouse gases, but also the biggest investor in renewable energy technology. Ahead of the conference, a landmark deal was agreed between China and the US. Some saw it as a template of how the developed and the developing world can work together to find a fair solution to a common threat. The US pledged to cut its carbon emissions by up to 28% by 2025. China said its emissions will peak by 2030. The head of the Chinese delegation told CCTV he believed that, like that agreement, this conference can succeed if all parties listen to one another. It is necessary to make the agenda open and transparent. Different perspectives should be genuinely represented in order to reflect the inclusivity of the conference. If we can do these two things, I think the draft text of this year's conference will be accepted. But acceptance from everyone is still far off. So China's view of the talks at this stage can perhaps be described as cautious optimism. But no one here underestimates the difficulty of finding an agreement which takes into account so many opinions. Stephen Gibbs, CCTV, Lima.